guys it's your girl that's back with another video as you guys can tell by the title today's video is going to be my hygiene routine this is going to be a little bit of a sit down version where i go through all of my products and let you guys know my faves so before we get into this video make sure you give this video a thumbs up talk to me in the comments guys i love talking to you interacting with you guys and i will respond back so talk to me in the comments and also Turn on the post notifications if they're not ready so you know exactly when I post a video. Without further ado, let's get into it. The first thing that we're going to get into is some of the basics that come along with hygiene. So, the first step is that you need to drink water. I know everybody probably says this, but guys, it's 100%, 1000% the truth. Water is literally on this earth to nourish our bodies, hydrate them. It's the most naturalist thing that there is. So we need to make sure we are drinking that and putting that into our bodies every single day add a little lemon in there ginger you know whatever floats your boat which will 10 times the you know making it even more healthier for you guys so that's tip a tip to make sure you're drinking your water every day is to get a cute cup now these are two that I have, just like this pink color kitty one, then this regular one, but I know everybody is into the Stanleys and there's a lot of different cups out there. So just make sure you get a nice cute cup that will keep you motivated to want to drink your water. Step two is to make sure you take a shower, if not every day, then every other day. Because they actually say um, taking a shower every day is not good. For like your skin cells or whatever the case but nine out of ten i take a shower every night and it also depends if you're a morning shower person if you're a nighttime shower person whatever floats your boat but yes make sure you're also doing every step of your hygiene routine every day good when it comes to hygiene if you're not doing it every single day so yeah so let's get into body care me actually being in the shower as far as my shower routine for body wash it all depends what i'm using at the moment um as of right now i don't know how to pronounce this brand notorium sorry if that's not right but i'm using the glow getter multi-wash um oil gel guys this is literally i don't know just a fave honestly and it's pouring out um <laughs> this literally is like oil but then when you wash when you wet it it turns into a gel like a body wash um it's really moisturizing and it's just good for my skin overall they have other types like acne and smoother and different like their brand overall is top 10 so i definitely recommend you know indulging and getting trying one of their body washes to start and they actually have many ones now so they're only five dollars so hop on that i love trying trying many things instead of buying the whole thing you know to make sure that it's actually worth your money also go in with the eos um shaving cream now it's either i'm using this or i'm using like conditioner or something as far as shaving gel um that one is honestly 10 out of 10 i also use the es razor sometimes or the brand joy um because it has five razors which is top 10 it gets the job done every time like you would think that it wax okay now guys as far as down there my two favorite things are the dove sensitive skin and then i also like the ph balancing cleanser from love um, this is really good. It's not irritating at all. It doesn't have a scent. Um, I also like that for my underarms. So that is pH balance. It says vulva area. I'm sure they have other pH balancing body washes, whatever. But I really, really like that one. Um, so I use that. Sometimes I use that. Sometimes I just use the sensitive skin. The get you clean, no scent. Perfect for down there. You also should start by washing your body with this. Like, use an unscented antibacterial soap first. Even though... That's what I've seen somebody say. This is never, definitely not antibacterial, but, I mean, it's hypoallergenic. It's freaking free. But, um, you're supposed to use, like, 
those type of soaps first before you go in with a scented body wash or any type to really cleanse your skin and get anything that might be on there off before you just lather on strawberries and cream you feel me so yeah okay guys now as far as getting out of the shower my favorite type of moisturizers um i love the vaseline cocoa radiant this will have you literally like shiny fully moisturized no ashiness at all like 10 out of 10 i also like the method body lotion this smells it's so good y'all like it literally just smells vanilla and it just gives me like a warm comfy vibe my comfort smell is vanilla um so this is definitely 10 out of 10 and it's it's moisturizing i love using this when i get out the shower in the nighttime i just feel so like yummy um as far as deodorant guys if i'm not using dove i'm using the loom whole body deodorant um if you watch my other hygiene videos you know that i recommend this they also have different kinds so yeah i recommend either this one or the scent or the um sensitive skin one which is the blue one no guys i also have this from honeypot this is the calming lavender panty spray i haven't used this in a long time i'm not gonna lie but i just got it one day um you just you know like say if you got like you about to have a little up appointment i don't know you know you feel me you just supposed to spray this on your underwear let it you know dry whatever but yeah it says it says use daily to refresh air dry and go gently miss panties under arms feet and shoes so yeah You guys, I also um, have the bio oil for any, like, stretch marks on my body. This is what I use, you know, like, my thighs or anything like that. Um, from what I see, it does relatively work, but you do have to be consistent with it, like, every day, every night. Okay, guys, getting into the skincare, because I don't get my face on right now, but your girl's skin is clear, okay? So, let me... So as far as face washes go, I go back and forth between two. So I have the Body Shop Tea Tree Facial um, Cleansing Wash. I love Tea Tree for my face. I feel like it really deeply penetrates and gets all that dirt um, off my face. And it just makes me feel minty fresh, which makes me really feel like this is really clean, you know um i also use the peach slices snail rescue purifying cleanser um this cleanser is definitely what made my skin clear up like texture everything like it just this whole line actually they did recently go up in price which i did not love but they are they are worth it in my opinion so after i go in with my face wash i use my toner this is the Snail Rescue Blemish Busting Toner um, that helps with acne scars, toning your skin, making you have a clean, balanced tone for your face. Um, I have the Hyaluronic Acid. This basically just allows any um, moisture. This makes your skin really moisturized, basically. So it delivers deep hydration to plump your skin and I put that on before moisturizers or sunscreen and then I use either the black girl sunscreen or the CeraVe facial moisturizing lotion which this is my go-to honestly I'm not gonna lie I'll use this like if I go to the pool or the beach or something but this is what I use on a day-to-day -day basis and then as far as like moisturizer goes I use the CeraVe healing ointment this is really good for just clearing my skin and making it look very shiny but without feeling greasy and then guys i also use the jade roller and the um bro, i always forget what this is called and then while i'm editing i'll be like that's what it's called but i also use this for my face to sculpt and soothe after any face masks or anything like that okay next guys we're gonna get into dental now as far as dental i like to keep it sweet and short um 
I definitely I definitely recommend yo not my shirt. I definitely recommend changing your toothbrush at least every month. Like you feel me? And having a tongue scraper. Tongue scrapers are just so much better than brushing your tongue. Um but yeah y'all I use the Colgate Optic White toothpaste. This is like the best toothpaste. Honestly, I feel like it truly does whiten your teeth. Um I also used to use whitening strips but my teeth started to get a little too sensitive for them so i stopped but walmart and target has good like off-brand ones that are still really good as far as floss i go in with the grin devil minty flossers y'all can even get this at dollar tree literally i got this and this both at dollar tree so oh and ask me down below where any of these products are from if you guys want to know I also got my tongue scraper from Sheen. All right, next, you guys, I'm going to give you guys a little perfume collection. I do have more, um, like, mini ones, but I'm not going to go through every single little mini travel size one that I have. So, I'm going to give you guys the big ones that I have so far. I don't know with the face. We have Born in Roma, Valentino. This is my girl's go-to. Chef's kiss. Mwah, mwah, mwah. And then we also have The Good Girl by Carolina. This is like just so cute. And these two as a combo, chef's kiss. All right, next guys, we have Giorgio Armani's My Way. He has two more versions of this and they honestly smell so good. But this perfume is like top 10, you guys. Like when I wear this, people will be stopping me asking like, what are you wearing, what are you wearing? My Way, Giorgio Armani, eat down, okay? Next, we have the Jimmy Choo I Want You. This bottle is just so pretty to me, you guys. Um, it just smells so good. It gives me grown sexy vibes. This is actually a gift. So, yeah, love this down. We love we love perfume over here. I'm trying to stack my collection. Also, like I love perfume so much. Next, we have this um, black opium. This one actually also is kind of underrated i really don't be wearing this as much as i should mm, like it just smells so good i'm start wearing this more i got like a it's it's it gives me like room perfume limes but it has like a like a undertone of like lavender or no um vanilla like i can just smell it like it has an undertone of it's like musky vanilla vibes like it's just so good also, y'all know I had to throw this in here because this is actually so good, y'all. The Mix Bar perfume from freaking Target, Target brand perfume actually hit, y'all. This is the Vanilla Bourbon, and this is the Hair and Body Mist, and it actually does work for your hair, I promise. Like, then at least we have the Flower Bomb by um, Victor Ralph. This is also an underrated one. I got this a little while back but it does smell super super cute cute it's grown it's sexy you got the flowers like it's so bad yeah, guys that was all for today's video thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in my next one comment down anything you want to see from me bye